What is up, comic bottles? It's your homeboy Alex from Tapis Family Limited Comics, and I got my DJ Links little pin on and my DJ Links stick around shirt. But thank you, DJ Links, <laughs> from all the videos you guys seen. But anyways, today I have another mail call from DJ Links. I'm not sure if this is the Jason, uh, cause he was doing uh, also a giveaway on Jason's um, on Slotted Up's channel for the 500 subscriber giveaway, and I also want something from there from DJ Link. So I don't know if it's the slab or another T-shirt, and I also got some comic books to show you guys. So stay tuned. Get it like comic addicts. What is up, comic bottles? Excuse me. Hey, if you guys don't like it, hey, it's only marijuana. Only marijuana. For your guys' YouTube channel. Why can I take a bong rip on my YouTube channel and tell you guys what type of flavor it is in my bong? That was called Purple Punch. I should've guys, I should have shown you. Ha! I should have shown you an image of the nugget. But anyways, let's get back into it. Bro, I think I should show you my comic books first before I show you what I want from DJ Links. Anyways, this is the last comic book haul that I got from Robert at the Swami here at the Sunny Side. Why? You guys don't want to know. Brother, I was helping this guy Robert out sell his books, right? But anyways, let me get into it. It is the Special Lords of the Ultra Realms number one. It says suggested for mature readers only. It is not not it, this book is not for me because I'm very immature, unmature, immature. <laughs> but anyways, that is that is awesome cover. Radical. On to the next one, X Men in the in the spectacular Spider Man issue 197. I simply got that because of Spidey and the X-Men, bro, those are awesome people right there, awesome characters, how are you not going to cop that? But anyways, that is that. On to the next one, Mystery, Mr. E, bro, I got that because I thought this was kind of like a pretty cool cover. I like the art in it, the contrast, the shapes in it, it's awesome. That's the reason why I got it, and yes, it was a dollar. On to the next one. It is Batgirl issue number eight from the New 52. I am getting the Batgirl. Why? Because I dig the Batgirl. Batgirl is pretty dope. Pretty sexy too, man. And then the thing is the last shit, last shit, last issue that I got from, from Rob. And it is Batgirl uh, New 52 number three. Pretty cool, kicking ass right there. But yeah, man, and that was that. But anyways, as I was saying, this is my last, these are the last comic books that I'm gonna get from that guy, Rob, bro. Me and him, they didn't end up in good terms. Check this out, I was selling books for him, right? I was selling comic books for him, bro, and I ended up selling some of his books that I guess he didn't like the price for what I was selling. I was like, buddy, you were kind of overpricing some of these books, bro. He wanted like 20, $30 books that were some, $30 for some of the books that were like fucking $5 to $10. I was like, bro, you're overpricing these books. You're making me seem like a scalper. And whatever, you know, it ended up like that. I sold some of the spawn books. It was seven spawn books for five bucks, bro. I was like, dude, you have all these, like right there. He had like doubles and triples of the same books that I was selling. So I was like, cool, you didn't complain. You said you were already making enough money. You said, do what I can. So I did what I can. Uh, nobody was buying them, so I was like, you know what? I'm gonna drop them to five bucks a piece, and hey, somebody bought them. They took them, and I took them as money. And he's, at the end of the day, he was trying to say that I was pocketing money. Negative, brother. I don't need your money, and I will never steal from you. I don't need that, bro. I work, and I try to push my own books. You know, if people like that, bro, I don't need it in my life. He tried to say, hey, you know what? We'll start all over, work something new, and I said, negative. I'm gone. Peace. Thank you. Bye. But anyways, let's drop that off to the get off to what the prize I won from DJ Links from Jason's 500 subscriber giveaway. And let's pull that motherfucker out. I know. Oh, yes, it's a slam. I, did that. I know it's a slam. That I won. This is my second slam. I'm so excited. This is my first slam that I ever won. And that was from MJ Comics. And it came from Remy Q Studios. It's Ninjax number one. 
the gold chrome wrap around. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Fuck this tape! <laughs> Let's get to it. Come on! Come on! Come on, Lee! Come on! The web of Spider-Man 36! Oh my god! I get to have another slab! Thank you, DJ Leaks! Oh, it's a 9.2! Web of Spider-Man number 36, Marvel Comics! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! It says the first appearance of Tombstone, Looney Lincoln! Holy moly donut shop, you guys! Look at that! That is beautiful! Amazing, or in the words of DJ Leaks, phenomenal. Okay, Mama, you want to be? Okay, she wants a bottle. But anyways, guys, thank you for watching, and thank you, DJ Leaks, and thank you, Jason, and thank you for everybody stuck around to the end. I appreciate you guys. Stick around for more, and remember. Comic Vatos Locos forever. And I'm out and about like this because I gotta go get my, my daughter some milk. A rato. Woo! I get to own two now. Awesome! I know, you guys are like, look at this retard. He only has two slabs. But I own two slabs! Yeah! There is a power Deeper than friendship. What can stop us? Fuck those locals forever, carnal. Let's go! It's a bond you can never break.